Not enough minerals. Additional supply depots required. Vespine Geyser exhausted. A train is approaching through a tunnel in the northwest. At the ready. Like Who wants some? Go on. What needs killing? Sir, one of the trains got through. We can't let too many get past us or we'll miss the cargo we're looking for. SCVs are under attack. I'm going. Well, butter my biscuit. Yo. Yeah. A train is coming through the Western Tunnel. <clears throat> what? Bad news? Yeah, whatever. We hear you. Roger. Will do.
Not enough minerals. juicing the trains with. They're putting out bigger escorts, though. We better watch ourselves. Detecting electrical activity in the wreckage. Now let's see what they were so fired up to get their hands on. Adjective 23-46. Online. System recording. New 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 Gettysburg Defense Initiative. S submit access codes. Well, I'll be. It's an old Confederate adjutant. What intel's so important to go and dig her up to recover it? Sir, that adjutant we recovered is down in the lab. She's all powered up. Talk to me, old piece of junk. What do you know? User identified. Rainer, James, ex-marshal, Marsara colony. Join Sons of Korhal terrorist group. Status, criminal. Enough about me, darling. What else you got locked up in that synthetic head of yours? User status, criminal. Access denied. Playing hard to get, huh? We'll see about that. Ladies and gentlemen, each night I bring you the news in the most fair and balanced manner possible. But tonight I have a commentary. 
Some have asked me what the difference is between our leader, Emperor Mansk, and the traitor, Jim Rayner. They point out that Mansk rebelled against the government of his youth and came to power through the use of violence and subversion. Why is it wrong for Jim Rayner to rebel in similar fashion? There is a difference. When Emperor Mansk began his revolution, there was no threat hanging over humanity. James Rayner is waging his revolution while we are at war with two alien races. James Rayner, have you no conscience? Shouldn't you fall in line, putting your petty complaints aside as we struggle for humanity's very survival against this alien menace? Everyone's a critic. Robbing a train again get you feeling nostalgic? Damn straight. We must have hit the Shale Express a dozen times back in the day. <laughs> oh, that keeper never got old. Almost got us killed when they smartened up and started using Outriders to chase us. Never was a man of them could keep up with you on a vulture, Jimmy. Just add it to the fun. How the hell you got a job as Marshal after all that? <laughs> I'll never know. Robin Trains. We'll make a pirate out of you yet, Mr. Rena. Jim, let me in. What really happened on Tarsonis? Whatever it was, I can see it tearing you up inside. Tarsonis. That's where it all went down. Meng stole a psi emitter from the Confederacy and planted it there. He knew that it'd attract the Zerg and... Our revolution began that day. The day Meng murdered a whole planet and called it justice. My god. Billions of innocent people. That's... That's just... Monstrous. No wonder you hate him so much. Good old days, robbing trains, yada yada, bang bang, yeah. I'm making diamond backs. I've been looking for an encryption expert so we can access the adjutant we recovered. No luck so far. Colonel Orlin at Dead Man's Port can crack anything. Haven't been back there in a while. Say, didn't you end up getting married last time we were there? I told you before, if I knew what the prize was, I never would have joined that card game. 
There's just something about a lover's reunion that chokes me up.